video, I'm going to show you how to set up sponsored messages inside of ManyChat and how to use the brand new updates of targeting your audience better so the exact audience you want gets your messages. This will improve your open rates and click-through rates. Yay, conversion! <laughs> Hello there, friend. My name is Kelly Noble Mirabella, and I am happy to have you join me here on the ManyChat YouTube channel. Let's dive into the fun world of sponsored messages, but don't forget to leave your questions and comments below and hit that like button if you find any of this tutorial helpful and valuable. Sponsored messages on Facebook are super important and very powerful in connecting with your subscribers. Now that Facebook has updated the subscription messaging broadcast API and enforcing the no promotions outside of the 24 rule, marketers are left wondering, now what? <laughs> the answer to your promotional woes is sponsored messages. Facebook sponsored messages are messages that you pay to send out to everyone who has ever messaged your page. Now, this includes people who have unsubscribed, but does not include anyone who may have blocked your page in the past. It used to be that you had to create a custom audience prior to sending out these sponsored messages in order to avoid upsetting the people who already unsubscribed from your messages. But with the latest update ManyChat just put in place, you are now able to create your custom audiences on the fly right inside of ManyChat's ads dashboard. This is one of the little tricks I am going to teach you how to do in this very video. Let's jump on to ManyChat and let me show you how it's done. The first step in creating a sponsored message is to go over under Growth Tools and select Ads. Sponsored messages are a type of ad, so when you go up here to create a new ad, you'll just follow the same prompts as if you're creating any other kind of message ad. You're going to create a new campaign, and your campaign type are Messages and continue. New ad set. And right here under message destination, we are going to select sponsored message. Now you'll see here when I went from click to messenger to sponsored messages, audience block gets changed. You'll want to go down here, name your ad set. So to create your custom audience, just click on select audience, create custom audience. Select on the custom audience here, or you can create a lookalike audience, but for this specific type of ad, you're gonna want a custom audience. And again, our idea here is to make sure we're only sending these messages to our actual subscribers, live active subscribers, not people who have previously subscribed but then unsubscribed. Now mind you, in my example, I only have two people because this is a test account, but you're gonna want about a thousand people to create a good custom audience. Your best bet is to filter people based off of all your subscribers minus those people who are within the 24 hour range because you don't want to pay to send out a message to people who you can simply send a 24 hour message to. So go to filter, conditions, scroll down to last interaction, and we want anyone who has more than one day. So that means they haven't interacted after the 24 hours and it's gonna show you everyone who's outside of your 24 hour list. So we're gonna create that audience. And there you go. Now, if you go into your ads manager and you look at all of your current audiences, feel free to delete all the old audiences because they can stack up if you send out a lot of sponsored messages to various types of new custom audiences. So you don't have to worry about any of these, like the age, gender, location, because your custom audience is pretty much going to capture the right people unless you really want to narrow it down. Maybe you have a very large list. In that case, go for further targeting if you wish. Then we're gonna click on next and the platform is sponsored messages, next. Finally, we're gonna select our budget. You could do daily budget or a lifetime budget. I'm gonna just say $20 for the lifetime budget. It'll tell you if you don't have enough money for this particular ad, so don't worry about having enough money. And then I'm gonna have the ad start on the 17th and run all the way through the 31st, since this is going to be a Halloween-directed type ad. 
Something to keep in mind is if you only allow for one day or 24 hours to send out the messages, sponsored messages do not exactly work like broadcast. It turns out that end users can only receive one sponsored message inside of their inbox per day. So if you give your campaign a bit more time to deliver, it's more likely that more people on your targeted list will actually receive your message. So I'm gonna go ahead and spread that out and continue. Now you're going to set up your message. I'm just gonna say the latest workout series just got released because this is Mary's Fitness Coaching. Join us for a round of Fit After Candy Halloween special five day challenge, totally free. Now keep in mind, you cannot add the end user's actual name in here, so there's not a ton of personalization, but we can add a card, a quick reply, or a button, and our button can go to a website or to another flow. So in this case, I'm gonna send them to another flow that will walk them through what to expect in the Fit After Candy five day challenge and how they can get signed up. So once you're all set and you're ready to send it off to Facebook's ad manager, just click on send to Facebook. And that's it, your ad is ready to go. You can also go here in your ads account inside of ManyChat and you can see where it is in the review and approval phase. Once this ad goes live, it'll say approved right here and I'll start seeing the stats of how things are running. As you can see, ManyChat makes it crazy easy to create sponsored messages with custom audiences. Generally speaking, sponsored messages are very affordable, averaging about 10 cents per message opened. We would love to hear from you. Have you used sponsored messages yet? And if so, what did you think? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching today and be sure to subscribe to the ManyChat channel so you can stay up with the latest and greatest tutorials for all things ManyChat. Until next time, get out there and start building.